like they call it a one stop. It's like the place you need to get to and it looks like all your problems are solved. I have quite some experience in statistical analysis. It's always a challenge for me to begin to write programs and begin to interpret. But now there's a pipeline. I have the basic knowledge, but I don't have to waste my time writing all those programs. You know, you just click and you get the results you want and you can make your decision. I'm glad that I am one of the people participating in the development of this tool, in testing it to make sure that um, it serves the purpose. That is very innovative. You don't waste time working like a statistician when you should be breeding in the field, developing varieties, making choices, selecting. I don't know whether it exists anywhere else, but even if it does, it exists in the developed countries where people pay for such services. I believe most developing nations who will use the IBP are going to benefit a lot. Because the young scientists who are not as trained as people in the universities in US or Europe will be able to use tools. They can collect data in an automated fashion. We can have database. It's not like a paper-based uh, system where, you know, you can be beaten by rain in the tropics and that's it for your data, you know, in the field. But now we have all those kind of things, the tablets, we can collect data in the field. You can go straight and download. You don't need to waste time again to key in data. From that data you upload, you go to analyze through the, the analytical pipeline. I really raise hands for GCP for going that way because that is where they should go to.